I was able to find two power supplies and cords and I've been eating these so I'm going to take those out of that box. I've got two supplies here. I believe they're both the same as far as connectors go. It looks like it's going to be a is that a 24 pin? No, it's going to be a 2, 4, 6, 8. Yeah, it's got too many to count. Anyways, we're going to try that one. This one I have jumped out. I use this for testing purposes when I need something that's low voltage, so I'd rather not. Although this is the one I probably have to physically fit inside the machine, um, I'd rather use this other one just for the test. I'm not interested in fitting it into the machine tonight. I'm just interested in checking to see if it'll run because it's possible that something got damaged depending on the mode of failure here when that blew up. Did you hear something beep? Maybe I'm losing my mind. Anyways, um, so I'm going to open up this other computer here. This e-machines computer. And let's see if we can pull this power supply out. Actually, probably don't even have to pull it out. Um, all we got to do is, let's see here, now this is going to be annoying. That's a smaller connector than this one. Yeah, now interestingly enough, the connector on the board is the same size as this. What is this other supply? I don't know where, where to go. Here it is. Uh, let's see what this one is. This one's a match. So, for now, we're going to use this one. Also, because I know this one works. Or at least it worked last time I used it. It's been some time, so maybe it doesn't work anymore. I don't know. Alright, so we have this main connector here for the motherboard. We have a connection for the hard drive. We will need not need the connection for the optical drive, and then we have a plug over here, which, because of this daggone thing, is nearly unreachable. I don't know how I'm going to get that plug back in again. Okay, so remove remove this thing here. And let's see here. We are going to connect This is not going to be easy. Oh, the clip is broken off of this one. And this has a different uh, color scheme. Oh, brother. I hope this isn't a proprietary. Oh, wait a minute. I'm struggling immensely to actually see what these colors are. These two look the same to me. Alright, we're going to go with that. Usually I have somebody help me with the colors, but nobody here to help me today. Okay, that's in. Now, we've got to get...
I'm just going to set that on there like that. We got to get um, the hard drive powered up. Don't think it matters which one we use. Um, these Molex should all be the same. Yeah. Okay. So I'll plug this up and I'll plug this up. Okay, so that's all connected. So I'm just going to set this over here and I'm going to plug it up. I don't really want to stand next to it when I plug it in because I don't necessarily know if it was the I imagine it was the fault of the power supply, but it's potential that something else was wrong with this that caused that power supply to fail. So I'm going to take this, connect this cord, switch this on, and I'm going to move this over to this windowsill here. And I am going to hide under the table while I plug this in. It's not going to reach that much up there. Okay. Uh, yeah. All right, here we go. Um, I guess I should put the screen on because if, uh, if it happens to work, I'd like to be able to see what it's doing. So, to get the screen back. Still don't know if this screen works or not. <sighs> now, sometimes things that you would think are going to be relatively simple become unreasonably complicated and difficult. This was one of those times. Okay, and all left to do is plug in the computer mouse. Okay, the computer mouse is plugged in. I'm going to plug in the screen first. Okay, the screen is plugged in. I'm going to make sure his power supply is in a good frame in case it decides to to do something interesting excuse me okay I'm gonna plug in the computer now okay it's plugged in I'm gonna hit the power button all right looks like it's running And we have post. Alright, um, I'm going to cut the video here. We'll conclude this video and I'll do another one showing it running.